I believe that climate change is the biggest challenge of our generation. If you look at the biggest culprits of energy consumption, the building sector is one of the largest consumers. If we want to convince real estate developers, investors, landlords that it's not only good for the planet to invest in these new technologies and innovations, we really have to convince them and show empirical evidence that, that these buildings, that it's not only helping the planet at large or reduce climate change or reduce their environmental footprint, if you will, but also helps their bottom line. So my research focuses on commercial buildings, looks at how we can incentivize building owners and investors tenants maybe even, how to improve energy efficiency and sustainability in the built environment. And that really goes back to recognizing that buildings are such a large consumer of resources and energy. In the US, 40% of energy is consumed in buildings. Almost 75% of electricity is consumed in buildings. In Canada, those statistics are a little bit lower. Well, research shows that more energy efficient and sustainable buildings have a transaction price premium, a rent premium, and higher and more stable occupancy rates. So those three together provide a financial incentives for developers and building owners to invest in these new technologies. How does an environmentally friendly building or an energy efficient or sustainable building help our employees? So are they more productive in this environment? Or do we observe less sick days? Are they overall happier? Buildings cannot move. When we combine that with an increasing frequency of natural disasters, think about flooding, wildfires, even tidal flooding in cities such as Miami, and we have property companies worldwide that have enormous amounts of capital invested in buildings. And how can we start to understand how these large portfolios for listed and unlisted companies, how are they impacted by climate change? And that's where a lot of the current concern is at.